In cooperation with the U.S. Department of Justice, Bureau of Justice Assistance, and the Valor Initiative, the National Law Enforcement Officers Memorial Fund is engaged in the Destination Zero program, which acknowledges effective officer safety and wellness initiatives that help drive down the risk factors proven to lead to officer injuries and deaths. Each year, numerous law enforcement agencies submit their safety programs to the Destination Zero program, and four law enforcement agencies are selected as winners of the coveted National Officer Safety and Wellness Award. Each month, one of the winners or finalists from the previous year is featured on the Destination Zero website. This month's featured initiative is the Orange County, California Sheriff's Department Traffic Safety Program. The Orange County Sheriff's Department took proactive steps to reduce crashes, injuries, and the subsequent liability that often arose out of crashes. These steps were a serious move towards creating a needed culture of safety and were designed to instill safe behaviors and decisions on the part of their deputies as they performed their duties from behind the wheel of a police car. In 2014, the department launched a traffic safety campaign called For Your Partners, For Your Family focusing on seatbelt usage, minimizing distracted driving, and using speed appropriate to the situation. This large department, which serves in a variety of capacities, has multiple divisions and over a thousand vehicles in its fleet. A traffic safety initiative committee creates safety messaging and issues reports to the sheriff. In addition to working to reduce crashes and increase the use of seatbelts, the OCSD also monitors its deputies' speeds. In a 2014 field operations advisory, Sheriff Sandra Hutchins issued a message about collisions, urging members to take steps to protect themselves. Like its state counterpart in Yolo County, California, a 2015 National Officer Safety and Wellness Award winner, the OCSD set a threshold of 90 miles per hour that would trigger a review by a supervisor. Since instituting this speed monitoring process, vehicle analytics show a significant drop in incidents of deputies traveling at speeds of over 90 miles per hour. The OCSD created a mission statement and set out goals and objectives so that its members could clearly understand what the agency was striving for and how it involved them. The mission of the Traffic Safety Initiative is to provide the highest quality driver training and education to our department personnel ensuring the safety of our employees and the citizens we serve while simultaneously decreasing personal injuries, property damage, and liability when responding to calls for service. The Traffic Safety Initiative also took the step of producing highly polished video reminders designed to impress upon deputies the need to take a moment and buckle their safety belt. Priority 1, 12 Sam 1, copy for info. 18 1226. 18 1226, AOA Station 32, officer needs assistance. Shots fired in the area. 913 for code 3 response. 
1226 code 3. Daddy, aren't you going to wear your seatbelt? As an important and impactful reminder, the sheriff had a number of wrecked cruisers bearing the campaign logo placed in front of or in the parking lots of their department's station houses. This served as a constant and personal reminder of the costs of driving too fast, becoming distracted, or operating in an unsafe manner. Recent data reveals that collisions were down from 62 in the second quarter of 2015 to 38 in the third quarter, a 39% decrease. Additionally, 100% of the deputies involved in collisions in the third quarter were wearing their seatbelts. To learn more about this program and others like it, go to www.destinationzero.org and click on the Search Resources tab in the upper right corner of the home page and type Traffic into the search bar. This will allow you to sample all of the submitted officer traffic safety programs and resources available on the site. To learn more about the Destination Zero program or to nominate a law enforcement agency safety program for the National Officer Safety and Wellness Award, contact Nick Brule, Director of Officer Safety and Wellness at the National Law Enforcement Officers Memorial Fund at 202-737-7864 or email nbrule at nleomf.org. You may submit your own agency safety or wellness program or that of another agency. The more information we share, the safer we all will be.